Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Wolf and welcome back to a let's play of Never Alone, the Fox Sales DLC. Ooh. Ooh, you had me worried there, little girl. Continuing pretty much where we left off. What do you want me to do with this? Do I throw it in the boat? Ah, I do. And now we gotta chase the boat and die. Apparently we have to chase the boat and die. Come on, hand it over. Thank you, spirit thingy. Okay, let's race it. Let's race the boat. Oh, hopefully we don't actually literally have to race the boat. Because that would be wor worrisome. So can I hop back in now? Okay, let's go. So this changes the whole dynamics of the game, just being now, look, in the boat alone. Look. Oh my god. The mouse has been exposed to like large amounts of radiation or something. At another village, Noah Tuck Village, Noah Tuckers had been telling a story about a canyon. Any big boat that came through the main river to the Noah Tuck was also swallowed. That's scary. <laughs> Row, row, row your boat. Gently down the stream. In your tulla bar hooting, niggas hooting low. A go hooting, no knock them to Nanon. I'm not a courting gun at Nick. There we go. So, what do I do with this? Now, paddle the boat, Vox. Okay, apparently, you can't paddle the boxes, the boat. As the fox. So... That's a shame. I like that the physics... It, yeah, I like that the physics in this sort of propels the boat. So let's take you... Oh! Apparently this is what we are meant to do. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then we throw you in here. Okay, get the little foxy down here. Oh, yeah. Stay in the boat. Oh, fuck my life. Okay, guys, uh, I know both me and you want to see what's going to happen. Oh. I thought it was going to kill me or something, but okay. That is really scary, and I just know that I, it's going to be a boss fight. You know it's going to be a boss fight. I kind of wish there was a, a different mechanic for the paddling, though. I It just... This feels a, bit, a little bit cool, but a little bit odd at the same time using the analog stick to paddle. Hmm, okay, this one's a bit of a puzzle. Yep, wait for the boat to... Give me another one. Oh, protector. Protector person. God damn it. You can just... Oh, you don't have to face that direction. You just have to paddle in the opposite direction. Hmm. I know. Get a little foxy down there. Okay, you come up. Yeah. No. Can't you just knock it down, you stupid bum holio? Okay, up we go. Little girl. You row, row the boat. Gently down the stream. Okay, up we go. 
up we go. That's it. I like how they just gently place it on the ground. <laughs> okay, there we go. We drop you in here. Bam! And now little foxy boy. He's gonna go swimmy swimmy down here. Okay, now you shoot me up up here. And I go up 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 up. I like the little breathing sounds he makes when you come out of the water. I hope that there's no like situation where I have to row the boat away from the boss. Oh crap. I guess we have to jump. Get ready to jump. Go little girl. We freaking made it. Because we're so badass. No, see the rowing the rowing needs a bit of work. It's it, it, it's it's kind of annoying that it, it can you wanna go one direction, it kinda goes another. I don't know. So pull push down. Drop. Yeah, there we go. Ooh. You did nothing. What the? What did you just... What did you do that for? No, other way, please. Yeah, the, the, I can see the rowing is going to get me frustrated because... You see, I wanted to go back. But see, if I, if I... I don't know how to explain it. Like, if I pull the, the analog stick to the right, she does that. And then if I move it left, she'll go that way. And then if I pull it to the left and go do that, she'll go... You know, from left to right, she does that. But then, if I go, if I push it to the right, she'll do that. And then if I go left, she she keeps going in the same direction. Do you know what I mean? It doesn't, it it doesn't seem to care which direction you push it in, as long as you've already sort of decided to go one way. You're basically screwed. So the game isn't without its flaws. Like definitely not not without its flaws. It seems they've introduced a new mechanic, which equally introduces. Some... Some new problems. And then BAM. How am I gonna get it down? That's the question. Hmm. Ooh. Ooh, it's still rolling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's that open? Let's go this way though. See if there's anything of interest over here. Oh god damn, little girl. Little girl, come on. This is... I heard the owl. The owl's up here. Oh no. I can hear the owl. Um, let's go this way then. Interesting. Ah, oh, maybe. Oh no, I can't, I can't, oh god. That's a tad bit irritating. Um, it won't let me jump unless I have this to jump off. No, no, other way. Yeah, there we go. Okay. And stop there. Yeah! There we go, so that's what this exists for. <gasps> Let's watch it! The Provider! Yeah! I don't want to miss a single owl, okay? That's my dad. Picture of my dad. Appa Willie. My, my grandfather, Willie. He was a respected hunter. So he was the provider for the large family. 
My father embodied all the Indian Path values. He used them all as much as he can every day. And he loved to talk to people. He shared a lot of stuff that he got from out, whether it be out in the ocean or on land. He shared with people. We all loved him because he treated us with respect, all of us kids. Uh, when we followed him, when I started to follow him with John to go hunt out in the ocean out here, he would talk to us while we're hunting and point things out to us. You know, how to expect things, how to do things out in the country, or... It uh, teaches how to set traps, where to put the traps, how to bait them. My dad was born and raised in Selwick. He grew up in springtime and summertime using a kayak. And they can go on days on a kayak. So he taught us all that about hunting seals, bearded seals, and then uh, hunting beluga also. You know, he he showed us how. I never forget my dad. Every time he said something, I honor what he say. I remember he'd wake me up after early in the morning, five o'clock, five dark. o'clock. He'd kiss me in his cheek, wake me up. I remember he said, "Bye, John. You behave now." I'll never forget that. So one day he did that. He said, if anything happened to me, I want you to take care of mom, like I did. But I, I see the affection there and the bond he had with me. He taught me. Oh, that's really nice. Okay, let's go back. Gonna swim down and see what we can unlock. Can you go down? He won't go down. Okay. Down? Down? Why is my controller like going nuts? Swim faster. That's it. <gasps> okay, down we go. Oh, the girl. Oh, God, now he's gonna swim all the way back. Down. Yes, down. Down. Okay, that's a bit, it's a bit odd, a little oddly frustrating. Okay, ooh. Don't you dare get caught, little girl. What is this place? Oh no! Ah! Oh. Frickin' hell. Do I have to restart all of that? Oh, thank God. I don't. Ooh, this place looks nice. Nice and interesting. Do we get up here without... Don't! Fucking... Ooh... Oh dear. Okay, we need to do something with this spirit here, obviously. Otherwise, he's just gonna eat. There we go. Little girl, throw it in. Hmm. Okay. That doesn't... Oh! Has to be timed. Maybe. Okay, get near... Alright. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, go! 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 Quickly! Yeah! You see that? Oh no! But that... There we go. Not so hard. Well, what's happening? Why was she taking so long? Oh god, that was a... 
Abingak pag inyaksok narvame, supaya kasi tikitsok narvamon negip lugo. I was gonna say that that rat thing is getting pretty scary. Ilan narik lisemaruk ang yung itparong awing ngapak no tarmit ikseseng yung narat. Okay, so we're going after going after the rat thingy. When the two brothers arrived at the lake, one brother told the other, "Go into the water." The mouse has his place somewhere in this lake. He sits watching the lake. That's not very nice. Anyways, I'm going to end that one there. I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, please let me know in the comments below. I'd really appreciate it. Let me know what you're thinking of this game so far. Whether you're thinking of purchasing it or at least following it. Like I said, I highly recommend the game. And if you haven't bought it, why? Why not? Uh, I want to know why. You probably have some good reasons, so you don't really have to tell me why. I'm just, I'm just asking. Um, but anyways... That's it for this video, and as usual, I will see you in the next video.